Hey, what up, superstars? It's your boy. I bet on me with some more Destiny 2 content. Hey, got another great video for you guys today regarding a pulse rifle you want to get your hands on, and it's called the Stars in Shadow. And this is a brand new legendary pulse rifle making its way into Destiny 2. So I'm gonna show you guys how to get the Stars in Shadow, and also a God Roll guide for the Stars in Shadow. And I believe this weapon has the most God Roll traits I have ever seen in Destiny 2 on a pulse rifle. So right before we get into it, if you guys do like great Destiny need to content regarding pvp and pve weapon reviews how to videos subclass builds great gameplay a little bit of destiny 2 news and destiny 1 this is definitely the channel for you so go ahead and click that sub and notification bell and it definitely helps support the channel i obtained this weapon by a random drop after playing crucible control gameplay but if you guys know any other ways to get this weapon definitely let us know down in the comment section this is a high impact frame pulse rifle it has slow firing and high damage this weapon is more accurate when stationary and aiming and down sights and the curator roll comes with a new perk called thresh and i put a fire beside that because this is a possible guy roll trait that can really change the game so it's killing combatants with this weapon generate a small amount of super energy now this is a 340 rounds per minute 28 in the magazine and its gun has a range of 66 which is really good now for the pvp guy roll just know this weapon has so many guy roll traits but the better ones in my opinion have the arrow and the best have the sticker and when you see the fire that is a brand new trait brought into the game that could possibly be a god roll so in line number one the best is going to be arrowhead break add plus 10 to handling plus 30 to recoil also small bore add plus 7 to range plus 7 to stability line number two accurize rounds add plus 10 to range and also tactical mag you add plus 5 to stability plus 10 to magazine and plus 10 to reload now in line number three we want to go with quick draw this weapon can be drawn unbelievably fast the new trait surplus increase handling reload speed and stability for each fully charged ability but the best is going to be killing wind final blows grant increased mobility weapon range and handling for a short duration and in line number four kill clip is going to be the best reloading after the kill grass increased damage you also have snapshot sights faster time to aim down sight and then you have moving target increased movement speed and target acquisition while moving while aiming down sights now for your PvE God roll, in line number one, the best is going to be Chambered Compensator. Add plus 10 to stability, plus 10 to recoil, minus 5 to handling. Also, you have Extended Barrel. Add plus 10 to range, plus 10 to recoil, minus 10 to handling. And line number two, we want to go with Tactical Mag again. That's going to be the best, but also Flared Magwell at the bottom. Add plus 5 to stability, plus 15 to reload speed. In line number three, we have Surplus again, but the best is going to be Killing Wind. But then another good one is going to be Feed frenzy each rapid kill with this weapon progressively increases reload speed for a short time and then in line number four we want to go with kill clip again but then also at the bottom we want to go ahead and go with vorpal weapon increase damage against bosses vehicles and guardians with their super active all right guys so let me know what's the best role for you and until next time that you buy bet on me sand peace hope to see you guardians in the destiny universe let's team up and have some fun you guys have a blessed day